Good morning, everyone. My name's Joy Parkins, and I'm the restaurant manager. And that none of you have had any previous experience as kitchen assistants. Well, Us now, but most of our kitchen assistants say they enjoy the work. Okay, they might get shouted at some. Think personal, and they're pleased that they have so many different things to do, which means they never get bored. Tell you straight away that if you do well, we might think about moving you up and giving you some more responsibility. Right, well, you've all shown up on time, which is an excellent start. None of you have unsuitable footwear, so that's good. You need to be careful. can get very wet and slippery. Those of you with long hair have got it well out of the way. need to remove your rings and bracelets. Just put them somewhere safe for today. Leave them at home tomorrow, as they can be a safety hazard. Now, it's going to be a today. We don't have any tables free for this evening and only a few for lunch. Fortunately, we've got our head chef back. He was a Last week, which meant the other chefs had extra work. Now, I'll tell you a bit more about it. But first, some general regulations. For all of you, whatever your age, there's some equipment you mustn't use until you've been properly trained. the waste disposal system, for example. The reasons. Then... Two of you here who are under 18. That's Emma and Jake, isn't it?
So for you two, the meat slicer is out of bounds. And you are allowed to use the electric mixer until you've been shown how it works. You may have heard that this can be a stressful job, and I have to say that can be true. Working an eight-hour day for the first week, though... ...to do overtime after that as well if you want to. But however long... ...you'll get a break in the middle. What you will find is that you're on your feet lifting and carrying. So, if you're not fit now, you soon will be. You'll find you don't have much chance to take it easy. You to do something, you need to do it straight away. We do have a very efficient air conditioning system compared with some kitchens. Now, let me tell you about some of the people you need to know. So, as I said, Parkins, and I decide who does what during the day and how long they work for. Trying to get you to work with as many different people in the kitchen as possible so that you learn job. One person whose name is David Field. Injure yourself at all. You must report to him. Incident is recorded and you get the appropriate treatment. He's trained to give basic. Self, or he'll send you off somewhere else if necessary. Then there's De He's the person you need to see if you smash a plate or something like that. Don't just leave it and hope. It's really important to get things noted and replaced, or there could be problems later.
Finally, there's Mike Smith. He's the member of staff who takes care of all the stores of perishables. If you notice we're getting low in flour or sugar or something, make sure you let him know so he can put in an order.